This section's awfully stubby. Info from stop, thief, and a silent influence needs to be added on receiving an invitation from the doctor. River escaped from Storm Cage to meet Amy, Rory and him in Utah in the United States on the 22nd of April, 2011. TV, The Impossible Astronaut, The Doctor, inside a Tesselecta double of himself, took them on a picnic where the Tesselecta was shot by River's younger self. Amy, Rory and River went to a cafe to find a version of the 11th Doctor 200 years younger than the one inside the Tesselecta. TV, The Impossible Astronaut, The Wedding of River Song, River secretly revisited her childhood when she accompanied her parents, the 11th Doctor, and Canton Everett Delaware III to Florida on 8 April 1969 to find the little girl who kept ringing Richard Nixon. Adhering to the doctor's rule against spoilers, which could collapse time, she feigned ignorance of her childhood self's identity. The only information she gave the doctor about her old spacesuit was that which she could have reasonably determined by her inspection of it and she offered Amy and Canton no forewarning about what they would find in her old orphanage. Any knowledge she may have retained about the silence she kept to herself. TV, The Impossible Astronaut, River, Amy, Rory, Canton, and the doctor split up to investigate the silence across America over the next three months. By July, River was in New York City. She showed her reliance upon and faith in the doctor and his TARDIS being in the right place and time to rescue her as she dove backwards out of the 50th floor of a building and into the TARDIS, swimming pool. She helped the doctor defeat the silence by using their brainwashing of humanity against them, while making sure she did not meet her first incarnation. River killed all of the silence who were holding her mother hostage. At her request, the doctor returned her to Stormcage, where she kissed him. He was shocked and she realized that from his perspective, it was their first kiss. TV, Day of the Moon. Using her Vortex Manipulator, River returned to Demon's Run shortly after the conclusion of the Battle of Demon's Run, mere minutes after Covarian had fled with her infant body. As the doctor angrily confronted her on her refusal to help, River pointed out how his own actions had led to the events of the battle due to making people so afraid of him. As the doctor demanded to know her real identity, River showed the doctor his old cot and the prayer leaf inside it, cluing him in to her parentage and true nature. As the doctor raced off to locate baby Melody, Amy demanded answers from River. In response, River showed her parents the prayer leaf upon which the name, Melody Pond, became, River Song, in the language of the Gamma Forests and explained that she was their daughter. TV, A Good Man Goes to War, 